Hello, everyone. Can't believe Shocker's loose again. You're welcome. Shouldn't have been working for a gangster. You might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong. Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic, insatiable ego. Now, if I'm a mentally unstable person, and I see him getting all this coverage, what am I going to do? It's called copycat behavior, people, and it's ruining New York. Not too far now. away boy wow officers respond we've got a 1010 narcotics in progress Reported location is the Garment District. Over. Advised, we have an assault reported in progress. Need immediate response at Union Square. Shocker. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just slow me down! Wow, that's considerate. What's the money for, Herman? Why do you care? Actually, I don't. 
just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking! But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level! Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman! At least talk to me so we can make it interesting! Gotcha. Now let's talk. Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Not enough. Move, move, move! Ooh. Okay, okay, I don't remember that. Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Awesome. It looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. No, this is business. All right, so that's where we are. What is this? That's the police department? Okay. So everything is done here. Since we have free time, why don't we get these last few antennas up? Hmm. That's a shame we can't fast travel. We are like all the way on the other side of the world. Wow. Okay, so let's get a waypoint. Uh, this one's closest. Alright, ooh, 3,000 miles away. Alright, no time like the present. to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, 
I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sense of the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Mugging reported. Need an officer on the scene. Proceed to Sutton Place. Over. Narcotic sale in progress. Location is Museum Mile. Over. It's all good, Spidey. Don't all worry right. about it. Awesomeness. And once we have the city mapped, we can absolutely get into some other trouble. Alright, so back in that direction. Pass it? They did pass it. You say hi to my kid? Oh, I did pass it. I think I was just having Breaking too much report. fun. We need an officer on the scene. Need additional officers near Sycamore. Robbery in progress. 
Available officers, move on Yorkville. So the next closest one is that way. I just love the web slinging. One of the best parts of the game. Awesome. Mm -hmm. you see that? That one in the red, that's the Kingpin's building. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we only have three more to go, and then we can. Uh, Jump back and get some um, get some stuff done. Get some real body work going. Wrong place. Wrong place. Where am I going? Following the wrong marker. Logging reported. Proceed with caution. Suspects are armed. Move in on Central Park. Over.
to headquarters. Okay. Active drug deal reported. Any units in the vicinity, please respond. Nearest officer, proceed to Robinson. Hey, we don't need you here right now, all right? Yeah, you always need me. Awesome. Heart alone. Okay. Light it up, Spotty. Light it up. Petty crooks. Oh, where'd it go? Oh, they got away? Oh, you bastard. Alright. So, let's see. Storm in the castle. That's pretty close. Alright, so we go do that. And that's that. Every crime tower in the city is now repaired. Pretty good work, right? Pretty good, yeah. Good enough that maybe you'd let a certain someone celebrate with us? <sighs> Fine, but make it quick. The odds were long, the danger close. But between Spider Cop's reckless intuition and the Chief's determined planning, they got the job done. Aw, that's kind of sweet. A pairing of opposites. Like peanut butter and chocolate, or breakfast for dinner. The two work together. And we're done. Talk to you later, Spider Cop. She's coming around, right? Yeah, definitely. Hey, Spider Man! You should check this out. Okay. 10 30. We've got a robbery in progress. Doing a little nighttime bird watching? Well, I was watching for nocturnal raptors in the park when I noticed a bunch of men armed with rifles over at Belvedere Castle. Thanks for the heads up, Miss, uh... Stephanie, let me know if I can help. I'll keep an eye on the activities from up here. Thanks for the assist, Stephanie. Why would armed men be at Belvedere Castle? Got a hunch know. they're not tourists. I'm gonna find out, aren't we? See the rifles. Okay, so we have to figure out a way to get there. Okay, so we cannot swing over water where there's no place to shoot a line to. Alrighty. Okay, 
Okay, come on, Spidey, swim for it. Okay, we can get up here. Fisk's men. This isn't good. Let's take a look. These three guys, four, we have six, at least six guys. Closer. Nothing here. Must be Spider Man. What? Anyone else I literally didn't see that coming. Never getting out of here. Lucky shot. Back him down. I'll teach you some respect. That's all of them. Let's find out what they were up to. Not sure what's going on here. Wonder if there's any info I can get from this flash drive. Awesome. Stephanie, a bird just stole a flash drive full of evidence. Maybe a pigeon. Is that normal? It is nesting season, so I'm not surprised. You know, I think there's a nest in the trees just southeast of the castle. Great. I'll check it out. He's got buddies. Great. Come back with that flash drive, you dirty sky rats! Try positive reinforcement. You know, pigeons are actually remarkably intelligent. Remarkably intelligent, huh? Uh, hey, pigeons! Sorry about the dirty sky rats thing. Maybe we can make a deal? Whatever Fisk is paying you in birdseed, I'll double it! Doesn't have the drive. Fuck this.
drive. Back to the laptop to see what Fisk's men were up to. Looks like they were uploading a worm to the Central Park Wi-Fi system. This could give them backdoor access to a ton of personal data. Come to think of it, even I use this network. Wait, it's still uploading remotely. There must be multiple access points. Stephanie, you're my eyes in the sky. See anything else strange in the park? Uh, I see a pair of horned owls and... Oh, more guys at a nearby junction box. Thanks. Keep a lookout for anything else. I need to get to that junction box before the upload completes. If they can't access the laptop, they can't upload. Get it! Got it! Knock him out! Thanks for the heads up. I better get moving. Two more? I never thought I'd say this. Uh, Why does Central on. Park need such strong Wi-Fi coverage? I thought people came here to get away. There they are. I need to keep them away from that box. Free! Hey, there he is! Come on! Fight you the worst uh, me! People of Manhattan can rest easy knowing that their passwords and cat videos are safe. Spider-Man? I think they might have seen me. Oh no. Are you sure? Uh, pretty sure. Armed men just arrived. Lock the roof entrance and hold tight. I'm on my way. Where are you? Where are you? I need to get to Stephanie before Fisk's men do. She wouldn't be involved if it weren't for me. They're trying to break down the door. We know you're working with the spider. Open up! Nearly there. Split up and find the girl with the binoculars. Freeze! 
Spider-Man. Take him out. Then toss the girl over the edge. Hey! Ah, uh, yeah. This is for the boss. Give for the boss. Check on Stephanie. Oh, thank you, Spider-Man. That was a little more exciting than my average night of birding. Hey, thank you. Your eagle eyes stopped an incarcerated crime boss from harvesting half the city's personal data. Not too shabby, huh? Plus, I found a nest of red-breasted nuthatches when you triple-kick that guy in the face. Real beauties, <laughs> too. You want to check them out? Thanks, but uh, I think I'll focus on jailbirds for now. All right, what's next? Wow, the mask. All right, well, let's go get the mask done. I think are worthy of further discussion like this one. I see reports of Spider-Man hovering around radio towers. At first, I thought he was sabotaging them. But a far more alarming possibility came to mind. In his misguided delusion that he is protecting us, is he hacking into all our conversations? Business deals, credit card transactions, those personal calls with the wife when you're on a long, lonely book tour. I mean, when one is on a book tour, I wasn't talking about myself. I don't do that sort of thing. And anyone who thinks they have recordings of me doing it is wrong. <laughs> uh... Joe Gina. Tired there, I had to take a little quick little break. 10 10. 
Man, need an officer to respond to a reported drug deal. Please proceed to Bowery. Should I really be spying on these guys? A CD drug deal. Who can peg those rich guys? I don't know. Spider Man! Cover the product! Ah, oh, come on, fellas! You can't keep ducking income tax like this! Me off at the jail. No reason. And that's just. Nice. Knocking the ever loving stuffing out of dealers is my anti drug. Mm -hmm. That's how I roll. Right there. I texted that's Yuri how I to roll. pick these guys up. I wish there was a spidey emoji I could put at the end. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Looks like May's not in yet. I could patch these shoes. They'll last a while. Mm. Aha! I'm on a roll now. Peter! You're so thin. Are you eating? Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane, she's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where'd she find it? I'm really not sure. Why, what is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Uh, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. 
Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment at Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. 
Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter. There's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. All right, so we're going to call it right here. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. And we will pick up. Norman never listens to Harry. Even tried to kill funding for his next. research stations. I hope you hey, enjoyed it. One of those stations is nearby. Thanks for stopping by. See how they're by. doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. <laughs>